Speaking about healthy, it's a nice looking day outside. Meteorologist Devin Lucy live in the Weather Center. Yeah. That looks really good on the Mississippi Gulf Coast behind you. Good day to do some running and biking, right? Keep in yes. shape so you can go head to those places. <laughs> Burn off those calories. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Island View Casino Cam behind me looking fine. And then we got beautiful blue that's still here. A couple of clouds had made their way in. Little bit more humidity has started to move in also with some south winds, and that's what we've been expecting. But the thing is, the humidity is not going to be enough to really bring in some widespread rain chances over the next few days. So there's a look at the clear skies that we had here today and real time temps. We've made our ways to the mid 70s as well. 76 Bogalusa, a typical warm spot. Our state's capital of Baton Rouge at 77. Fish I saw us top out about 75. Maybe we went to 76 today. And we're already ticking back temps as now we're in the fall season. That sunset getting to about 628, if not a degree or a minute or two earlier. South winds you can see here at about 5 to 10, and that's a wind speed averaged over a couple of minutes. Dew points had been down into the 40s, and now we've moved back to mid 50s or so. It had just been so dry, you may have noticed just that little bit of uptick today. I was a runner earlier, I kind of noticed it. Okay, temperatures on the way up, even despite a warm or a cold front, rather. It's not going to get any cooler, it actually warms. I'll show you why. But don't expect much rain with it, as I already showed. It's just not high enough humidity to add a lot of rain chances or to break out a lot of storms in the atmosphere. So there's a look at the mild temps in place, a little bit of humidity return. There's the front that nears, but watch as it gets here. There's not a whole lot to be forecast. Another part of it is the most energetic part of that storm that would help pull up that humidity and give us that intrusion into the atmosphere to break out storms is way, way north. But at low temperatures not going to be as chilly with a little bump of the humidity. 50s to start off tomorrow morning, 50s to 60s North Shore, South Shore. And there's a couple of clouds and there might be an isolated shower or storm, but it's a 20% chance as I just showed. Not much is being forecast north of I-12, but maybe south of I-10 we could get a couple of showers, especially as you get a little higher humidity. Dew points up to 60, but not any higher. And temps continue to go up to maybe 80 tomorrow. Got to watch out on the waters, though, behind the front as we'll show. The winds will start to pick up, so an exercise caution comes in overnight Thursday going into Friday as well. Tidal range starting to peak up, though, so maybe some good fishing if you can avoid the wind. Lows Friday morning, even up a little bit more so, as we're low to mid-60s with little higher humidity to mid-60s that are still here. But the front essentially comes through, and then it's all about the winds after the front's through into Friday. Look at the dew points back down again, so the rush of dry air behind the front, but we're actually warmer. A lot of that due to the west flow, one of our warmer winds and even southwest winds if we could tap into it, which this forecast wants to do, pick up those southwest winds a little bit late in the day. But anyway, you look at it, it's just going to be a warm forecast as we get past going into the weekend and even beyond, with temperatures still to the low 80s. But newest was our tropical storm Tammy that formed here today, the 19th named system of the season. This will have no impact on Louisiana whatsoever. It's going to stay out to sea. It's going to bend north of even Puerto Rico, which is good news for them, and even maybe just starting to brush Bermuda, staying tropical storm strength. But our WDSU first warning weather seven day forecast to 81 tomorrow as the Saints are in town, slightest chance shower. But then after that, it is still warm, but at least the humidity is down going to the weekend too.